The highest mountains in the world are a source of fascination and wonder for people all over the globe. These majestic peaks, located in the Himalayas, stand as a testament to the power and beauty of nature, as well as the human drive to explore and conquer the unknown. From the towering heights of Mount Everest, to the sheer rock faces of K2, to the stunning vistas of Kanchenjunga and beyond, each mountain on this list presents a unique challenge and adventure for climbers and adventurers. Despite the risks and difficulties involved in scaling these peaks, they continue to draw people from all corners of the globe, who are seeking the ultimate test of strength, courage, and endurance. In this video, we will explore the 10 highest mountains in the world, their unique features, and the challenges and rewards they offer to those brave enough to attempt their ascent. Number 1. Mount Everest, 8,848 meters, 29,029 feet. Mount Everest is the highest peak in the world, with an elevation of 8,848 meters, 29,029 feet, above sea level. It is located in the Himalayas on the border between Nepal and Tibet, and is known in Nepali as Sigurmatha and in Tibetan as Chomolunga. The mountain was first measured in 1856, and named after Sir George Everest, a British surveyor general who had worked on mapping the Indian subcontinent. Climbing Mount Everest is considered one of the greatest challenges in mountaineering, with only a small percentage of those who attempt it successfully reaching the summit. The first successful ascent of the mountain was achieved in 1953 by Sir Edmund Hillary of New Zealand and Tenzing Norgay, a Sherpa from Nepal. Number 2. K2 to 8,611 meters, 28,251 feet. Mount K2, also known as Chogori or Godwin Austin, is the second highest peak in the world, standing at an elevation of 8,611 meters, 28,251 feet, above sea level. It is located on the border between Pakistan and China, in the Karakoram mountain range. The name K2 comes from the survey designation given to the mountain during the Great Trigonometric Survey of India, where it was labeled as Karakoram II. Climbing K2 is considered to be one of the most challenging and dangerous climbs in the world. It is known for its steep, icy terrain, unpredictable weather, and high altitude, which can cause altitude sickness and other health problems for climbers. The first successful ascent of K2 was made in 1954 by an Italian expedition, led by Ardito de Zio. Number 3. Kinchinjunga, 8,586 meters, 28,169 feet. The Kinchinjunga mountain range is located in the eastern Himalayas, on the border between Nepal and India. It is the third highest peak in the world, with an elevation of 8,586 meters, 28,169 feet, above sea level. The name Kinchinjunga means, five treasures of snow, in Tibetan, referring to the five peaks of the mountain. The mountain is considered sacred by many of the local people, and is a popular destination for mountaineers and trekkers from around the world. The first successful ascent of Kinchinjunga was made in 1955 by a British expedition led by Charles Evans. Number 4. Lhotse, 8,516 meters, 27,940 feet. The Lhotse mountain range is located on the border between Nepal and Tibet, near Mount Everest. It is the fourth highest peak in the world, with an elevation of 8,516 meters, 27,940 feet, above sea level. The name Lhotse means, South Peak, in Tibetan, referring to its position south of Mount Everest. The mountain is known for its steep, icy terrain and challenging climbing conditions, with many climbers considering it to be one of the most difficult mountains to climb in the world. The first successful ascent of Lhotse was made in 1956 by a Swiss team led by Ernst Ries and Fritz Luxinger. Number 5. Makalu, 8,485 meters, 27,838 feet. The Makalu mountain range is located in the Mahalingor Himalayas, on the border between Nepal and Tibet. It is the fifth highest peak in the world, with an elevation of 8,485 meters, 27,838 feet, above sea level. The mountain is named after the Hindu goddess of wealth and prosperity, and is known for its rugged, steep terrain and challenging climbing conditions. The mountain is also home to a rich biodiversity, with a variety of plant and animal species living in the surrounding area. The first successful ascent of Makalu was made in 1955 by a French team led by Jean Franco and Lionel Touré. 
Number 6. Cho Oyu, 8,188 meters, 26,864 feet. The Cho Oyu mountain range is located on the border between Nepal and Tibet, in the Himalayas. It is the sixth highest peak in the world, with an elevation of 8,188 meters, 26,864 feet, above sea level. The name Cho Oyu means, turquoise goddess, in Tibetan, referring to the mountain's striking turquoise color, which is caused by the glacial ice that covers its slopes. The mountain is known for its stunning beauty and challenging climbing conditions, and is a popular destination for mountaineers and trekkers from around the world. The first successful ascent of Cho Oyu was made in 1954 by an Austrian team led by Joseph Jockeler. Number 7. Dalagiri, 8,167 meters, 26,795 feet. The Dalagiri mountain range is located in the central part of Nepal, in the Himalayas. It is the seventh highest peak in the world, with an elevation of 8,167 meters, 26,795 feet, above sea level. The name Dalagiri means, White Mountain, in Sanskrit, referring to the mountain's snow-capped peaks and icy slopes. The mountain is known for its rugged, remote terrain and challenging climbing conditions, and is a popular destination for experienced mountaineers from around the world. The first successful ascent of Dalagiri was made in 1960 by a Swiss-Austrian team led by Max Eiselin. Number 8. Manasla 8,163 meters, 26,781 feet. The Manasla mountain range is located in the northern part of Nepal, near the border with Tibet. It is the eighth highest peak in the world, with an elevation of 8,163 meters, 26,781 feet, above sea level. The mountain is named after the Sanskrit word, Manasa, which means, intellect, or, soul, and is considered by many to be one of the most beautiful and awe-inspiring mountains in the world. The Manasla range is known for its rugged, remote terrain and challenging climbing conditions, and is a popular destination for experienced mountaineers from around the world. The first successful ascent of Manasla was made in 1956 by a Japanese team led by Tashio Imanishi. Number 9. Nanga Parbat, 8,126 meters, 26,660 feet. Nanga Parbat is a mountain range located in the western part of the Himalayas, on the border between India and Pakistan. It is the ninth highest peak in the world, with an elevation of 8,126 meters, 26,660 feet, above sea level. The mountain is known for its rugged, steep terrain and challenging climbing conditions, and is considered by many to be one of the most difficult and dangerous mountains to climb. The name Nanga Parbat means, Naked Mountain, in Urdu, referring to the mountain's striking appearance, which is characterized by sheer rock faces and vertical cliffs. The first successful ascent of Nanga Parbat was made in 1953 by a German-Austrian team led by Hermann Buhl. Number 10. Annapurna, 8,091 meters, 26,545 feet. The Annapurna mountain range is located in central Nepal, in the Himalayas. It is a series of peaks, with the highest being Annapurna I, which stands at 8,091 meters, 26,545 feet, above sea level. The range is known for its rugged, remote terrain and challenging climbing conditions, and is a popular destination for experienced mountaineers from around the world. The name Annapurna is derived from Sanskrit, and means, goddess of the harvests, reflecting the rich agricultural traditions of the region. The first successful ascent of Annapurna I was made in 1950 by a French team led by Maurice Herzog. The ten highest mountains in the world stand as a testament to the enduring power and majesty of nature, as well as the human desire to explore and conquer the unknown. Each peak on this list presents its own unique set of challenges and rewards, from the icy slopes of Mount Everest to the rugged terrain of Annapurna. Climbing these mountains requires a combination of strength, skill, and perseverance, and those who attempt the ascent often face extreme danger and hardship. Despite the risks involved, Climbers and adventurers continue to be drawn to these peaks, inspired by the spirit of exploration and the desire to push their limits to the very edge of what is possible. As we continue to explore and appreciate these incredible mountains, we are reminded of the enduring power and beauty of the natural world, and the limitless potential of the human spirit.